Hi, and welcome back to my channel, you guys. So I'm excited about this week's travel video because this week I'm going to be talking about Carnival has expanded its Bermuda Cruises through 2020. So Carnival Cruise Line will operate its largest Bermuda season. Did I say Bermuda or Bahamas? Okay. Hi, welcome back to my channel, you guys. I'm super excited about today's travel video because today I'm going to be talking about how Carnival is set to expand Bermuda Cruises through 2020. So Carnival Cruise Line will operate its largest Bermuda season ever in 2019 and 2020 with over 40, did y'all hear what I just said, over 40 voyages visiting the destination, including eight week long cruises departing from Baltimore and Charleston. In total, six different Carnival ships, the Carnival Breeze, the Carnival Magic, the Carnival Pride, the Carnival Radiance, the Carnival Sunshine, and the Carnival Sunrise will offer four to nine day Bermuda cruises from five home ports along the eastern seaboard between now and next year. In addition to round trip departures from Charleston, Port Canaveral, and Fort Lauderdale, nine day Bermuda departures have also been added to the New York based schedules on Carnival Sunrise and Carnival Radiance, including four day cruises to the island as well. The seven-week-long cruises to Bermuda from Baltimore will be offered aboard the Carnival Pride and spend three days in Bermuda, while a seven-day cruise from Charleston aboard Carnival Sunshine will offer two days on the island, along with a visit to the private, private bohemian destination of Princess K. May 31st, August 2nd and 23rd, September 6th and 20th, and October 4th and 18th, 2020. The cruise from Charleston departs October the 17th to 2020. While in Bermuda, guests can visit the island's pink beaches, snorkel, kayak, and visit historical landmarks such as the Royal Naval Dockyard and Gibbs Hill Lighthouse. Shopping, dining, and golfing experiences are also available. For more information on Carnival Cruise Line's itineraries, you want to visit Carnival.com or just reach out to me and I can book your cruise for you. So, you guys, let me say something. When I did something just I said brought back a memory. When I said talk I was talking about visiting the pink beaches, we I told you I think I told you guys before I had the opportunity to visit the, the um Bermuda absolutely beautiful absolutely beautiful the people were just wonderful and we actually went to the beach and the beach that we went to call it's called horseshoe bay beach and the sand is pink you guys i kid you not do you see i can't can you see how pink this shirt is it's a little lighter than my shirt very soft very oh my god it was just absolutely beautiful i had never in my life been to a beach and saw anything but just regular brown sand but this sand is actually pink and i'm gonna tell you a little secret i actually brought some back in a little jar it had a lid on it and do you know i had had that sand for so so long and then about i'm gonna say maybe six or seven years ago I accidentally, I, I was downstairs in the basement because I was sitting on the shelf, and I accidentally, I turned around, my hand hit it, and it hit the ground. I thought, oh my God, no, because I have no way of getting pink sand unless I go back to, to Bermuda to get some more pink sand, and I highly doubt that I'm going to do that just for sand, but you know, I'm not going to rule it out. I may have to do another cruise because it was absolutely phenomenal, the best experience ever because it was just, like I said, but I didn't go on Carnival. I went on, uh, oh God, what was the cruise line? Mm -mm -mm. It wasn't Royal Caribbean, wasn't Carnival. God, and of course I can't think of it because I want to tell you guys. But anyway, I had a great time. My mom had a great time. My sister and my daughter had an amazing time on this ship because it was absolutely phenomenal so if you ever get a chance to go on a cruise to the Baha to to bermuda and you want to check please make sure you go check out those pink beaches the sand like i said is so phenomenal so soft and just absolutely gorgeous so that's all i have you guys i want to say thank you so much to my newest subscribers thank you so much to those of you that continue to support me and all that i do i love you guys to the moon and back and y'all know the drills nothing you can do about it absolutely nothing you can do about it because i'm gonna love you anyhow i look forward to seeing you guys 
on the beaches of the world some way, somewhere, somehow. And hopefully, maybe, I'll just see you where we can get, get some pink sand together. Until next time, take care.